Hey agents, so today we got the target loot allocation for June 29th, 2020. This is Shadow Gaming, and if you like the content, go ahead and subscribe, thumbs up, and if you don't, thumbs down. Alright, let's start with the Dark Zones, DC, and the New York City. We got Mass at DZ West, Richter and Kaiser at DZ South, and Knee Pads at DZ East. So, the biggest thing that I see in the dark zones there's two obviously we got the hollow man mask in dz west and then for knee pads i would say the emperor's guard normally i would also say the ninja bike messenger pads but they drop in the dc area the light zone now so you wouldn't need to go get them over in the dz east area but i'm assuming that they're gonna drop pretty easily in the dark zone if you do want to go and try to grab them or an extra one whatever you want but the emperor's guard knee pads is something that i would try to go for and get over here in manny national zoo we have knee pads so if you're looking for the ninja bike ones i would just go here if you're looking for emperor's guard go to dz east because it is a dz exclusive all right so let's hit up dc and then new york city so in the northern areas we got gila guard at camp white oak body armor at coney island amusement park or sorry ballpark and knee pads at manning national zoo alp summit at amusement park coney island i would recommend gila guard for all shield builds like usual chess pieces if you need sacrifice or pristine example knee pads for ninja bike you know, those are the ones that i'd recommend for the northern area all right, so the highlights for West Side would be Fenris Group AB at Federal Emergency Bunker, Hana U at Bank Headquarters, Marksman Rifles at Foggy Bottom, and Backpacks at DCD Headquarters, Submachine Guns at Lincoln Memorial, Group of Sombro at Tidal Basin, and we got Marksman Rifles at DARPA, Light Machine Guns at the Pentagon. Now, there isn't a whole lot I'd recommend in the West Side area that's really big, but you know, if you're looking for Hana, you are Fenris, you can hit up these missions for sure. Same with Sokolo Concern. Backpacks is not a good spot. You can run this mission over and over again really fast. That's also true with the submachine guns, like if you're looking for Lady Death, or if you're still looking to get more chatterboxes without doing the quest line, I would just do the quest line for the chatterbox. Then you can go to Lincoln Memorial. I'd recommend this highly for the Lady Death though. That's a really good day to get the Lady Death. And, you know, with Marksman Rifles, the Nemesis and the Mantis, they both uh, have either a quest line or like the Mantis on the Season Track, which is now targeted loot after you reach Season Level 55, if you're trying to get another one. And then Light Machine Guns, Bullet King, Pestilence, Good Times Named uh, Light Machine Gun. You can go try to get it at the Pentagon, but, you know, I don't think there's another area with Light Machine Guns today, so if you need to go to the Pentagon for Bullet King or Pestilence, go for it all right highlights for the east side we got gloves at grand washington hotel holsters at judiciary square we got chess pieces again at jefferson trade center seska sro at viewpoint museum we do got rifles at east mall and capitol building and here's probably the best thing we got today walker harris and co at space administration hq and providence defense at space oh sorry at space administration hq walker harris co at southwest so this is the one that i'm going to be getting all day so i just put out a video last night where you go to no hope hotel and just clear it over and over again there is this um i don't know if it's a glitch or something i don't think it's a glitch it just it puts you behind this desk in the control point every time you reset it so if you want to go and check the video out it'll explain everything about it uh, i would highly recommend going there because i'm getting over 600 thousand i think it's 692,000 experience points every time i clear this control point with four three other people and you know the loot's good because it's like as you can see in the top right i have four directives on so i would go over here and check that out and watch the video for the exact instructions same with providence defense if you're at space administration hq run that over and over again as well all right let's go to new york city and then we'll be done all right, we got Golan gear at the Tombs and Wyvernware Civic Center, gloves at Two Bridges, assault rifles at Pathway Park, Murakami at Battery Park, skill attachments at Financial District, ooh, light machine guns at Wall Street, and shotguns at Liberty Island. If you're looking for the Bullet King, 
just go here and get it. You can get the Pestilence and the Bullet King from targeted loot and the boss drops it. So this is one of those days where this is an amazing day to get this done and to get the Bullet King. So I would highly recommend this. And you know, you can go try to get the Sweet Dreams with the Liberty or a good shotgun, but uh, Liberty Island isn't really that good. It's a farm over and over again in my opinion. And you know, if you're looking for Wyvernware or Golan, uh, Wyvernware or Golan gear, go get it. But I, I just would highly recommend this as well. And then Assault Rifles, if you're looking for P416, Famasas, Military AKMs, the Chameleon, definitely hit up Pathway Park too. That's a good mission to go over and over again. Alright guys, so that's it for the target loot allocation for June 29th, 2020. This has been Shadow Gaming. Take care agents, and I'll see you in the next video. Take care agents. Bye.